Jim and I were down at the Pike Street Market one day about, oh, I don't know, six years ago or something, whenever it was, and a recruiter came through, and we saw him hand, I saw him handing out little, little uh, refrigerator magnets and ballpoint pens to children, 12 years old, 14 years old. I lost it. I just complete, well, he lost it too, but he had a lot more control than I did. I completely lost it, and I, I nearly, I, I almost attacked the man, and I called him a child molester. I remember calling him a child molester. I said, you get out of here, and we ran him basically out of the market, and then Jim went down later on and actually talked with the market authorities about it, and they said, no, they're not allowed in here. So the Pike Street Market is a uh, recruiter-free zone. Yes, indeed. Anyway, um, there's, a f I, there's a great old, I'm a little, I'm really tired. I've been working on a recording project, and I've gotten like very little sleep for the last like however long it's been, so my mind is like putty. But I remember when the, 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 the shock and awe thing went over. Don't you love those words they use? Like it's like fun, like it's some kind of like game, like it's really cool to blow all these people up. Shock and awe, isn't that just it's like a disco party or something? And anyway, when that's, I, I just went, I flipped. It's like, I got to do something. You've got it. This is, this is a tool. People have different tools. This is mine. David uses it too. So does George. It's like, it's a tool that we use, you know? So we were raised with this song when Johnny is marching home, you know, and it's hurrah, hurrah. And everybody's, the, 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 they're marching back from the civil war. There's not a mark on them. There's no PhD. There's, there's no post-traumatic stress. There's no, there's no wounds. Everybody's fine. The, the streets are lined with dogs and children and apple pies. And it's a beautiful thing. That's what we were raised on. I was raised on. Well, there's a, the, the, the song came from an old Irish folk song, which was much more to the point. And it was uh, called Johnny, I Hardly Knew You. And the chorus goes, with your guns and drums and drums and guns, the enemy nearly slew you. Oh, Johnny, dear, you look so queer. Johnny, I hardly knew you. You know, the guy comes back and he's not the same. He doesn't even now have all his body parts. And it's his wife talking to him, saying, who's going to take care of the children now? Who's going to keep our lives going together now? Look at what, we're going to have to put you out with a bowl to beg. Because it's an amazing song. It's just an amazing song. And it was an Irishman, in all fairness, <laughs> who rewrote it for money, for America, to have a pro-war song so that when, so that, you know, the public sentiment could keep going. You know, nobody's free of this crap. Anybody can do it. They did it to their own song. But this guy did it to his own national song. So I figured this would become our national song, Johnny Kids Marching Home. So I figured I would take it and I would rewrite it back into its original intent, but update it. I saved two of the original verses. I took out the part about hooray, hooray, or haru, haru, because I don't talk like that. You know, and I'm not going to sing like I don't talk. So it's just, you know, and it's just called When Johnny Kids Marching Home. And it goes like this. Is marching home again. When Johnny comes marching home again. When Johnny comes marching home again, we'll all go out and welcome him. Never mind the shape he's in. And we'll ask him how the fighting went. We'll ask him how the fighting went. We'll ask him how the fighting went and how he likes the president. Casualties are an act. And we'll beat our drums and wave our flags We'll beat our drums and wave our flags We'll beat our drums and wave our flags With great and grand and glorious rags The ones that put on the body bags And later on when the sickness comes Later on when the sickness comes Later on when the sickness comes From chemicals and uranium We'll wring our hands and we'll all play dumb.
See the old veterans who did their part. The veterans who did their part. See the veterans who did their part and came back home with a purple heart. Walking around with a shopping cart. See where all the legs he used to run. Where all the legs he used to run. Where all the legs he used to run before you went to carry a gun. Well, I'm afraid your dancing days are done. You have no arm, you have no leg. You have no arm, you have no leg. You have no arm, you have no leg. You're an armless, legless, chickenless egg. I'll have to put you out with a bowl to beg. Kill them and they'll kill us back. We'll kill them and they'll kill us back. We'll kill them and they'll kill us back. They say it's always been like that. Yeah, off of the banker and his money sack. So tip your hat and take a bow. And tip your hat and take a bow. Tip your hat and take a bow and get on with your life somehow. They're taking your little brother now. <laughs> 